Greetings on today. Grace and peace be unto you. Today is a special day. And as I reflect on the past and what the Lord has done for me, I have to share it and I have to talk about it just real briefly. This is the day that my youngest was born. But when I made five months and pregnant, I had ruptured membranes. That means I had no amniotic fluids or anything. And so they told me that he wasn't going to survive. But God had a plan in mind. I know some of y'all are carrying and you're wondering what is on the inside that you're carrying is going to die. But I got great news for you on today. I came to declare the works of the Lord on today to let you know that it shall not die. It will not die, but live and declare the works of the Lord. I am here to let you know that whatever purpose, what purpose, whatever it is that you're carrying, this business, a baby, whatever it is that you are pregnant with in this hour and in this season, I want you to know that it shall live and not die. I don't care what the doctors say because yes, they declared that he will not live. But God had a plan and I want you to know his plan is this, is to speak a word over your life that will keep you in this hour and in this season that will have you to be able to walk it out and to be able to birth forth what it is that you are impregnated with in this season. 20 years ago, back in October of 2000, when the doctors told me, they said, well, Miss Henry, they said, you might as well stay in the hospital for three months. This was October of 2000. And I told the doctor, I said, mister, I can't, I can't stay in the hospital that long. I have three children and a husband. They had me to sign documents. And when I signed that document, the spirit of the Lord spoke to me according to the scripture. And he said that he will not die, but live to declare the works of the Lord. And I came here to let you know about the works of the Lord, the past works of the Lord. And if he did it then, he can do it today. I am excited about what God is doing. And I came to give you a word of excitement in this pandemic season to let you know that what you are carrying it will not die. It will live and it will declare. You will be able to talk about it and tell people how good and how great God is. I want y'all to know that purpose, that purpose that is down on the inside of you, there's an expected day. And even if it may have to come premature, you better know that God is in control. I was five months pregnant when they spoke to me that my baby was not gonna live, but I trusted God. And two months later, he could not survive no longer on the inside. So they had to go in and do a C-section because he wasn't due to be born until February of 2001. But God had a plan in mind. God said that it shall not die, it shall not die but live. And I want you to know that whatever it is that you are carrying on the inside, whatever purpose you are carrying on the inside, I want you to know today that it shall not die, but live to declare the works of the Lord. On your way out from hearing this word, please comment happy birthday to my baby boy who is 20 years old. The Lord declared over his life 20 years ago while in the womb, that he shall not die, but live and declare the works of the Lord. Y'all have a blessed and prosperous day on purpose.